Hey, I'm Decathlon Gamer, and this is the Road of the Record, where I work to achieve mastery of 10 games and a hunt for the best score of the Decathlon. If you like to see, remember to hit that like button. If you want to see more, hit subscribe. Let the games begin. This is Dirt Rally 2.0, episode 18. This is the start of season number three. So I've gone through two full seasons of both Rally and Rally Cross. We're ready to start season three, which opens up with another rally season. We're going to be moving into a new car this year. Uh, my rules for this series are I've got to own every car before I can move on to that next classification. We own everything in the H1 category. We own everything in the front wheel drive H2 category, which is where we raced in season number two. And now we also own everything in the rear wheel drive category of H2. So that's where we're going to be uh, participating this season in Rally. Let's look at what my options are first. So we have uh, the Ford, the Ford Escort NK2. We have the Alpine Renault A110 1600S. We have the Fiat 131 Abarth Rally. And we have the Opel Cadet CGTE. Now, I have driven rear wheel drive in the original Dirt Rally. The first time I ever did it uh, was the first experience I had in that game of getting absolutely destroyed. It was really hard to keep it on the road. But by my second season, I had much improved. And by my third season of rear wheel drive, I was performing quite well. I never quite was where I was with the front wheel drives. I still had more off-road incidents, but by the end I was actually winning events. So that was Dirt Rally. Dirt Rally 2.0 if you haven't figured this out by now, if you haven't figured this out for watching me in this series, if you've seen previous episodes, is far more difficult than the original Dirt Rally. Far more difficult. So I am expecting another difficult season here. I'm expecting some growing pains. I am absolutely expecting that this time I will unlock engine tuning after that first couple, two or three rallies, or originally, and start using that to my advantage. Now, I did a little bit of research and I've heard that the Fiat is the easiest in this category to keep control of and not have as many problems with oversteer and therefore I will be selecting the, the Fiat uh, for this season. Now, quick, very, very quick recap. Rally Cross. Uh, I was in the Cross Cart, which is that special little itty bitty cage. Uh, tiny, tiny, super lightweight vehicle, but with a big motor that goes really fast. It's got crazy, crazy acceleration. It doesn't have high end speed. A crazy acceleration and when you're on dirt that just means the rear end is extremely unstable because of that the amount of acceleration it has and the light weight uh, of the vehicle I, I could get it going super fast I could have faster laps than everybody else in the field but I couldn't get clean races I won a single qualifying event I never made it to a semi-final in the season that was really rough I'm planning on doing a second season there, but I'm wondering now because my next classification, the way that's going to work, is from here, from the H2 rear wheel drive, it moves on to H3 rear wheel drive. And there are six cars to purchase before I can open uh, or before I can get out of that series. So I actually could get into it next season if I could buy even just one car. So. I, I might end up moving on to there next season, regardless of how I do with the Fiat. I may choose to do another one, uh, depending on how I'm performing this season, whether I'm making enough money, uh, because remember the damages I've got to pay to fix those damages, and it does take away uh, from the earnings. But my next class for Rallycross is the RX Lite. There's only one car to buy there. So a single car purchased will get me out of that next cl classification and back into a, a regular rallycross vehicle. Kind of like that idea. I really do. I, I, 
I, I suppose it'll depend on how this part of the season goes with the Fiat. Uh, but speaking of, let's not delay any further. Staff-wise, uh, I probably could afford an upgrade for Harris, our new engineer, as I do have 57000 in in the bank, but that's, that's not a lot. Uh, so, no staff upgrades today. Let's get into events season three, ready to get started with our next portion of the rally season. Again, as per my rules, the daily challenges, all of that stuff is off limits, and all of my work is rally, rally cross, rally, rally cross, rally, rally cross, going season by season. Oh boy. You're going to open in Argentina, the hardest race of the season. I suppose that's not a terrible thing. I can get the hardest one out of the way. There you go. The Fiat does have some damage already as we go, but I will be using the Fiat in this one. And wait, wait, wait. Do I have uh, at livery select? Let's see. Two, three, four. Yes, that's the right button. And the blue and white's not bad. I like green and black. Those are my colors. Definitely not the red. Orange and black's okay. The blue and black actually looks pretty nice. Uh, so blue and black or green and black. You know what? I like this blue and black. That's a nice livery. We'll, we'll take that. Alright. 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 Let's get you fixed. Standard. 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 Boy, that gearbox has some uh, expensive repairs, slightly, anyway. 2500 right off the bat before we even drive it. It was a used car that we purchased, so I get it. I get it. Hello? Hello? Confirm? There you go. Engine. Three possible upgrades, of course. We'll get there when we get there. Here are some upgrades, and here's one reason why I saved that money, because there's 32,000. I can go straight into the tuning now, the durability as well. We're gonna do it this time, we're gonna do it. Boom, engine tuning, finally going to be a thing for this series, for this channel. Yeah. Oops. No, no, no. There you go. So, we have some engine upgrades, but otherwise it's just going to be repairs now for this car. And we are ready to start our first event in Argentina. The toughest race on the calendar ends up being the first race on the calendar this season. Is that a combination? Is that a recipe for disaster? Uh, light rain showers here in the opening one won't matter quite as much in the heavy gravel, but it still will affect the grip somewhat. So I've got a, a rear wheel drive car for the first time in Dirt Rally 2.0. I'm already struggling with the front wheel drive cars. And then B, light rain, making grip even less so. And then C, we're in Argentina. So this is just about the worst combination you could ask for to open season number three. And I'm already feeling like anything other than last place. Outside of DNFs to not be last place, and actually even then, <laughs> uh, could be a minor victory. Could be a minor victory, just not being in last place here. Yeah, it's a, that's a decent blue and black. I, I like that. That's 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 looking nice. Uh, oof, ten shakedowns. Uh, I very well might be using them this time out because uh, we've got some engine tuning, um, vehicle tuning to to do. Oh, and there are a lot more options now. Uh, I don't want to mess with the tow yet, uh, but the brakes. That could be a thing. Let me see here. Uh, I would like some front. Wow, it's already heavily front bias, uh, which means that rear end is going to kick out a bit to keep that front end or less where you want it. Um, differential. 
changing the diff obviously would also open it up a little bit now there's not going to be as much oh, there's not going to be as much here uh, need for higher gearing but at the same time you lower the gearing too much here at Argentina yeah you, that rear end's gonna kick out even easier I think I need to just start with what we have uh, at least for this first shakedown and then build from there surface degradation is moderate thanks to the heavy gravel I at least have that going for me but uh, Five, away we four, go three two, one, go. 60 bump, into four right, 30, one right long, opens, into four right, into three left, don't cut, and keep right, 30, open heavy left. That was that oversteer, you get on that gas too hard too fast and it just really kicks out that, that end if you are trying to turn at the same time. 50. Yeah. Try to get that feel for how hard is it, how easy is it to kick out that rear end. Oh gosh. I got an engine scoop on the front. This is so 80s. <laughs> I gotta get that feel 30. for where we're at braking wise. How much braking they need, which I know I need a, a fair amount. That wasn't much of a quarter. It's actually a relatively easy first section there. I mean, I know I made mistakes, but uh, the unfortunate thing for me is I don't quite know yet where I need to be. So I'm gonna go straight into a second shakedown. Five, four. Sixty bump into four right thirty one right long opens into four right. Ooh, okay, that went a little too easy. I needed to into three left. Don't cut. Correct my steering a little sooner. Keep right thirty. Open air in left. Definitely, I've, I've tried to feel out. When and where? You know, where on the throttle am I losing the rear end? So, so that's the main reason why my, my cornering is really bad 15. at the moment. Slow, four right of a crest long, tightness toe. And you really got to get on that Into correction rest. of steering. Bring it back the other way. Opens, 30. Six I have to see, I get on that gas on the exit there, and it's going to just kick kick the rear end out. So I'm really going to have to learn that, my how to get on the gas on exits Just when I'm not losing the rear end at that point. That was actually worse. <laughs> that was a good six seconds slower than I was last time. But of course I was feeling things out. Still not sure. So the, the challenge that I'm facing here is the ultimate decision of how much do I want to deal with losing the rear end and having that that oversteer versus how much do I want to find a way to keep the wheels locked together, treat it like a four-wheel drive, slow down enough in the corners to not lose the rear end, and then keep that stability. So how much do I want pace versus stability uh, in this car? And, and that's, that's something that I'm not quite sure about just yet. Uh, and I, I, even after two runs, I don't feel there's an adjustment that I need just yet. There's just a, a familiarity Four, that I need. Three, two, one, go. Sixty bump. And at this point, I still do not know yet uh, where I'm at on. Opens. Uh, into four right. Uh, into three left. Don't cut. Keep right 30, open air bin left. Uh, 
Oh, I lost my train of thought here. Focus this time on trying to put together an actual decent... See, that would be one where the oversteer would be useful. And tower slide through. That was supposed to just go in slow around the corner. Opens 30. Six left of a crest, 50. To stop. Well done. Okay, okay, look at that. Much better on the time, much better on the comfort. I'm getting a feel for this car. Now again, the heavy gravel here helps lock this car in a little bit better and keeps that, that rear end from fishtailing too much uh, from that constant oversteer issue. But of course, it's also raining, so then that decreases that grip, so it's really hard to tell where I'm at at this point. But if I'm on the... <laughs> if I have a way to keep this car on the road, then I'm where I want to be, ultimately, for now. Uh, I'll find some pace later. I, I, I really don't care necessarily where I finish in this race. I want to keep the car in one piece as best I can. Uh, if that means I'm slow, I'm slow. Just, I'm probably pretty slow. <laughs> Uh, I don't know if I need seven more shakedowns and ensuing damage to the car. It's just body fix here. So, no tuning yet. Uh, let me get out there. I'm going to be 89th <sighs> heading out there, and there will be some degradation by that point. Stage one in Argentina. Start 60. 310 right, is the time. That's one four right sectors. So we're talking about, what, 40 seconds per sector? Is that, let's see. Five, no, four, more than that. 40, three, two, 42, 43 one, seconds a sector. Go. 60 bump. Into four right, 30. Which means I was well off pace from the class leader. <laughs> Opens. Into four right. Into three left on cut. Oh, 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 that was close. And Save. Yeah. Keep right, 30. Breaking's fine for this car. It slows down quickly enough. Stay off the rocks, stay off the rocks! Hit him again! Opens 30. Six left of a crest, 50. Ooh! Okay! Look at that! Green first sector? Unseen to uh, right. I don't know how many have gone ahead of me though. Into three left on the cut. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Recover. Into there we go. Two right small cut. Into two left long titans. So I guess the uh, rally Argentina was just Into last weekend right uh, in real life, and I, I've seen a few clips from the event, and for the most part, things do Into look a lot titans. like this. So they, they brought the general Into likeness in. Ooh, lots of oversteer there, but uh, good correction. Seven seconds down. Opens. I'm okay with being seven seconds down, especially when we spent that time up on that rock. That was at least five seconds lost just from that moment. I'm not worried about winning this thing. I'm just trying to keep it in one piece, really. I know the times are well down in this car compared to other cars. Uh, well, in this category, I mean, the, the, the racing class, the, the H2 rear, rear wheel drive. Way too slow. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. Into hairpin left. Into six right. Keep 
Left over 15. Right now. 15 down now. 30. Three left over bump into two right. 20. One right long tightens. Into five left. Into four right long of a crest. Into hairpin left. Into four right long of a crest. Into two left long. Tightens of a crest. Of a finish. 30 of a jumps. Caution. Four left. To stop. Okay, that was that was good. That was good. Two green sectors. Just 15 seconds down overall, uh, but that's, who are they comparing me to? That's 22nd. 22nd of whatever. That felt good. But that's, that's not last. Times. That's not last. That's not last in Argentina with the rear wheel drive. Yeah, sorry. I'm celebrating 22nd place. If you've seen where I've been at, you know you got to be celebrating with me. Come on. Come on. Give it to me. No? No? All right. Fine, fine. I'm in. I I am in. <laughs> I'm in the midst of the pack. That's 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 good. Uh, 15 seconds down to Thomas, but only 13 to second. And then you can see times really starting to bunch up. But there is room for growth. Plenty of room for growth. That was definitely not the fastest that I could have been. But it was fast. I mean, we look at that first first split time, and that is very much towards the front end of the back uh, the back of the field. Second split time, that was a little bit slower. That's where I hit those rocks, so I definitely lost some time there. That was at least five seconds. You take five seconds off that, and I'm near the front of this group. Split three, really difficult. Yeah, there there you go. There's the the replay up on those rocks, and yes, that was that was good. Four or five seconds lost. On, on that right there. You, you take that four or five seconds back and we're, we're looking pretty good. Uh, you know, of course, others had mistakes here and there too, but split three, mm, a little off pace to some, but definitely ahead of the pace to others. That was a difficult section. And split four, we were fast. Second fastest of all of those in the back end. So I could be middle of the pack. It could happen. I could maybe even earn a point or two in this race if we can get in the top 16. Just minor body damage as well, that, that's going to help. Freak Dust Cloud. Nice. Penty. Rocks in the road for Morton. Problems in some of the cars behind me that could slow them down in upcoming stages. I like where we're at. And, you know, the, the balance of the car, all things considered, it doesn't feel so bad. It's drivable as it is right now. Stage two, we've got some tight corners again, but this one does open up a lot more. There are some fast stretches here, a little bit less elevation change. We're still in the afternoon time. It's only cloudy now, so there should actually be even better grip. <laughs> Excuse me, sorry, wow. That sneeze almost didn't come and then it came. Definitely some tight chicanes still in this one, but they're coming off of higher speed straightaways. Starts so it's 30. actually more dangerous this stage. 50. Keep right of a jump, maybe. Into six left. Good luck. Five minutes. Five minutes is the target. Three, two, one. Go. 34 left. Opens 50. Keep right of a jump, maybe. Into six left. 30. Slow fall left into unseen one right. Opens. Keep right over 80. Unseen fall left. 30. 5 left. 60 over bumps. Caution. 1 left. Unseen. There we go. Here's the first tight corner. Into unseen. Hepping right. Ooh, still too fast. Still too fast. I thought I had it slow enough. Didn't want to turn once I got there, though. Into five left. Thirty. 
Come on. Come on. Four right. Into three left. Into two right Titans. Thirty. Cut. Three left long Titans. Into happy left. Unseen. Keep left of the thirty. Caution. Don't cut. Four right. Four left. Into unseen. One right. Small cut. Four left. Keep right of a thirty. Caution. Unseen. Happy left. Eight seconds. Into All things unseen, considered, especially right. going the wrong way through that one turn. Opens. That's okay. Into four right. 29th, though, Into out of 30, open, so that was left. a bit off the pace. Into open, happen right. Opens. Into three right of a crest. Into four left. Into one right tightens. Right of a 30. Three left long. Titans two. Just about recovered on that. I had a. Opens of a crest. Into five left. Much too speed right. through that corner. Got all the way to the outer right edge where those rocks were. I was running out of room. Kind of just bumped the rocks a couple times, but otherwise kept. Titans into open happy left. I was able to still push through. That was good. Into four right of a bump. Into caution. Five left. Thirty over bad bumps. Unseen. Happen right. Thirty. Six right. Oh, that was much 50. better. Breaking that time. Caution. Not quite on the apex though. Five left. Thirty. Crest and one left long. Oh, Titans. Happen. Shadow there. Threw me off. Only four seconds lost. And I move up a couple spots. Oh, oh, oh. Into if you look it on the track, not on the telemetry on the top right corner. <laughs> 30. Keep left of a crest bump into one right tightness. 50 over bumps. Two left tightness. 30. Three left, thirty. Turn unseen, two right. Keep right over fifty. One left, tightens. Thirty. Five right long, opens eighty. We're pushing a lot harder than I was able to push before. Still keeping control of the car for the most part. I mean, it hasn't been completely clean, but. Fifteen. Much better. I lost eight. I lost four. I lost two seconds. Can we cut that to one second this time? Cut it in half every time so far. Nineteen down overall. That was five seconds lost, but that's still much better. Seventeenth, it looks like overall. That's you know that's like right in the middle of the pack. What's going on here, Marshall? I've stopped multiple well, times. I Thank hope you. the tires are okay. There might be some radiator damage. 
But yeah, 17th. Okay, okay. 16th, could you still be in my future? Boy, those times are so close, though, from 6th to where we're at. 5.12 to 5.19. It's only 7 seconds to 6th place. Minute 9 on the last split was good. Minute 7 on the third split was the best of, of the middle of the field. Split 2 was right in the middle of it. And split 1 was... Really good too. So that, that was good. That was consistent. We got minor body damage, high engine temperature, broken headlight as we hit the front on that uh, first sector or we're shooting that one ter turn. So that's one mistake in each of the first two stages. Both of them costing about five seconds, maybe six seconds. And the, otherwise, a few minor bangs on, on rocks here and there, but otherwise, clean runs. Clean runs for the most part. That's really really good uh kraus had his car recovered we got a blown tire to nielsen uh who's a contender at the front and yet here they are towards the back got a chance to move up as some of the other cars might have some damage i'm in 20th overall just outside of the points right now uh let's see the gaps behind still not huge i mean we're talking half a minute to campbell and just a quarter to, to Mueller in, in 29th. So things are still very, very tight. Nobody's really dropping off uh, the pace. I'm a few tenths out of 19th. 16th, my target to score points, only four seconds behind. So only four seconds away from scoring points right now. And still outside of maybe, you know, the top three, four cars. We're still within reach of just about all of them. I mean, we're talking 20 seconds would put me, yeah, right there with fourth place. Goosens. That's just 20 seconds. Achievement unlocked. Rocky Road. Cool. Got an achievement. Okay, uh, so stage three, again, we have some really, really tight corners. For the most part, it's in stretches, so there, there's some more open areas and the turns aren't quite as tight coming through those. Uh, but again, towards the end of the stage, and this is a long, oh, it's a long stage, 5.13 miles. We've got uh, eight sectors. It's evening, so it's five o'clock in the evening. It's cloudy, no rain. Okay, okay, uh, we could see times, we could see time gaps be a bit larger here as we are looking at double, uh, double the race length compared to the first couple stages. Radiator, definitely want to fix, that's just two minutes, that's good. That's just six, lights, okay, hey, look at that. Easy fixes, 1600, confirm. I do not want to adjust the tuning as I'm finding the car quite comfortable to drive, at least for now. This I think the heavy gravel really helps here. Keep that rear end from pitching too much. Uh, so to keep us from having crazy oversteer. Now we're halfway through. Let me check on the tires, the mediums. Yeah, they're very used. Uh, let's go ahead and put on a fresh set of medium tires for the remainder of the race. Good, okay. Stage three. Start it's 30. Evening. Four left opens 50. Keep right of a jump, maybe. Into six so left. Let's go down, Good but luck. not down yet. Eight and a half minutes is our Five, target time. Four, three, two, one, go. 34 left opens 50. Keep right of a jump, maybe, into six left, 30. Slow four left, into unseen one right. Opens. Keep right of 80. Unseen four left, 30. Five left. 
60 over bumps, caution, one left, unseen. Into unseen hairpin, right narrow. Into five left, 30, four right. Into three left, into two right tightens. 30. Cut three left long Titans into really good so far. Unseen. Should be up there in the standings a bit, just three seconds off the pace. Keep left of a 30. Caution, don't cut for right. It's third fastest so far. Four left into unseen one right small cut. Four left. Keep right of a oh, 30. Oh, that, that, you said don't cut. I thought you said cut. You said don't cut. There's that oversteer back. Into four right. Into unseen open hairpin left. Opens. Okay, sector two not going so well so far, but it's Into open really, right. really tight turning here. Opens. We've lost Into some time. Right of a crest. Maybe four Into seconds. Left. Into not a major right mistake, but enough that I've, I've definitely lost some time. But we're doing okay still. We're just, we're right just fine. 30. Just fine. Three left long. Still okay. Still okay. Come on. Opens of a crest. Into four Box. left. Ooh, that was close. Four right. Into four left long bumpy. 30. Slow two right long. Titans into four oh, oh. left. Oh! 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 Ah, oh, come on. Slow two right long. Shoot. Six second penalty. Fans had to push me back over. Ah. Just caught that rock and sent me around. Or sent me over onto two. And then couldn't save it. This card sits to where the, the top end, you know, there, there's no way to drive yourself back out of that. Some cars you can, some cars you can spin those wheels, and if you're sitting in the right position, you can get back onto all four yourself. This car doesn't do that. The fenders sit up in such a way, not gonna happen. But of course, as is always the case in Rally, there's somebody nearby ready to uh, help and get you back right. Keep left of a crest bump into one right tightness. I'm a ways off from the class leader now, but I'm still not in a desperate bumps. position or anything. Two left. Still looking decent. Still making good time right now. 20 seconds. Uh, drop me to 11th. That's, that's 11th. <laughs> that's not 30th. It's not 17th. It's not 20th where I am in the standings right now, so... Gaining time. Green sector. Turn four left long Titans. Thirty. Close call there. Keep right of a junction. Into four left. And don't cut three left. Into one right. Into six left. Fifty. Oh, we've been right here. Okay. Thirty. Three left. Very long. Opens. Titans. One. Fifty. Five right. Into four left. Into four Again, right. nineteen. Opens. Up to ninth. Two left narrow. 
60. Bumps into four right. 30. One right long. Opens. Four right. Into three left. Don't cut. And Whoa. keep right. Whoa. 30. Open hairpin left. Uh, luckily, that wasn't too costly. That was the oversteer and unexpected. 50. I was too hard on the gas on a slight curve there and just lost, lost it instantly. And that was a very sudden <laughs> around we went. Luckily, just a few seconds lost there. Six left of a crest. 50. Just 21 seconds, so I, I could have maybe gained a couple seconds or one second or so again on that sector, but we into three drop a couple seconds is all. Still ninth. Into unseen, two right small cut. Ooh, ooh, oh, didn't know that was coming. Into two left long Titans. Oof, almost lost the rear in that time. Into two right long. This area is pretty slippery. Titans, Titans. Right. Titans. Into one left Titans. Opens long. Into turn, one right, don't cut. Into two left long, tightens, opens. Into two left long, tightens one. Into one right long, tightens, hairpin right. 30. One left long. Into six left. Oh, happy day! I gained five seconds. Four right long of a crest bump. Caution thirty. One right. Stay up, stay up, stay up. Good, nice. Into hand in left. Oh. Into six right. You said hairpin. Right narrow. Thirty. Three left of a bump. That's not a four. That's not a four right. Twenty. One right long tightens. Into five left. Into four right long of a crest. Into hairpin left. Into four right long of a crest. Into two left long, tightens of a crest, of a finish. Oh gosh, that wasn't the finish line. <laughs> that was the warning that you're coming up on it. Ah, oh, there we go. Yes! Ten seconds up into fifth place on the long stage. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Whew. Stage finished. Well done. <sighs> One to go. And we are moving up those standings. How far though? How far are we going to move up? Uh, I'm, I'm running low on time for this episode, so I, I need to keep things moving along. I did have that six second penalty. Really? Six seconds took me from fifth to 17th? Fifth? 8.30. 8.47. That's be because I wasn't the first one out there. Okay, the six second penalty knocked me from 11th to 17th. Not everybody had driven yet. Not everybody had driven yet. That makes sense. I was in 20th. So I was fifth out of 10 or something like that. I don't know. Uh, reverse order. No, it probably would have been fifth of 20. And the 10 behind me hadn't done. Morton has retired. Oaks is going to be well back. Let's go straight into where we are at. 14th. Up into the points. Up into the points. Can we hold it one stage to go? I'm six plus six seconds. Or I suppose you could say minus six seconds on the gap to the points. Second and a half out of 13th. One stage, one stage. Let's get to it because I should have about, oh, 10 seconds left on the episode. Oops. Hey, 
on stage to go. We did have a season two recap to go, and it's freaking Rally Argentina. It's the long one. It's the hard one. This one's going to be pretty open. You got some rhythm sections that are going to be some higher speed corners there in that last sector uh, to watch out for. Sector one is going to start, well, kind of the same thing here. You, you've got some tight corners, but a little bit of space in between them. This is going to be a higher speed sector, uh, fourth stage for sure. It's only two miles though, so times shouldn't be large gaps. This is a short one. Start 60, open hip in right tight. This is one set of the four sets of headlights. Good luck. Class leader th Five, three something, four, three seventeen. Three, two, one, go. Sixty, open hip in right tight. Into one left. Where is it? Where is it? Long. Still getting the dust of the cars in front of me. That's not a good thing. Hopefully it doesn't stay like that for long. Smoke cars done. Somebody just DNS. Corners are a lot tighter than what I thought they were going to be. Again, smoked dust. 1.5 up. Here's the one. Feedback on the wheel from uh, the grading there. Open happy left. I definitely bit into uh, the tires. You know, it's a sudden twitch in the car. That was not the force feedback that did that. That was the grading itself and grabbing those wheels for a moment. Second fastest right now, halfway through the stage, to King, or at least of those that have gone. I don't know if that's 10, 10 cars, 20 cars, wherever it was. Ooh, that was fast. That was the rear end just kicking out a little bit. Oh, did it again. That, that ended up slow because I had to readjust to make the bridge. Unseen hairpin right. Into hairpin left. 3.8 up. Fastest so far. It's not the full field. I don't, like I said, I don't know if it's reverse order grid or front order grid. I think it's front order grid in real life, so it should be front order grid, which would make me 20th, because it was at the third stage. 20th of the 30 cars. Opens into two right. So there will be 10 more behind me. Those times I don't have, but... But I've seen reverse order here before, in which case I'd be 10th. Almost there. I'm still ahead, I think. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> I have no idea how close that was. Oh, didn't expect that corner to be so tight. Almost there, almost there. Point seven off the pace of King, almost fastest. That does not mean I won the stage, even if I had been ahead of them. But that was still a fantastic time. Fantastic time. 348.6. 
That'll definitely be competitive. Sixth for the stage. Yes. So, okay, okay. Sixth place on the stage. That is my best result in a long, long time. And that brings us to the end of Rally Argentina with a ninth overall for the event. And I, one thing that makes me really happy. Look down the grid for me. 15th, DeVries, 7 seconds. Look ahead. 13 seconds to 8th. 7 seconds takes me to the edge of the page. One way doesn't even move me a spot the other way. So that is about as lucky as you can get on that matter. Ninth place, ninth place. Stemnes takes a win. Thomas, Goosens, Hoffman, and Clark are your top five. I come in in ninth and look at that Fiat all over the top ten with, what is that, seven of the top ten placings? I got the right car. <laughs> I got the right car. Wow. Okay. Ninth place is going to be worth some points here. First time I've scored points in a long time. Event finished. Ninth place. Ten points. Awesome. Hey, that's going to do it for this episode. I'm the Kathlon Gamer. And remember, I'm aiming for the best of the best. So if you're ready to join me on my journey, hit subscribe and tune in next time on my Road to the Record. Bye for now.